how to dress and hang a vertical designer radiator. To complete the installation, you may need an impact driver, a tape measure and or meter ruler, some PTFE tape, a pencil, an adjustable spanner, a 10mm spanner or wrench, a spirit level, and you may also need a set of radiator valves. With each of our vertical designer radiators, we supply a wall fixing kit. These are ideal for common masonry walls. If unsure on any part of this installation process, please do not proceed and consult a qualified professional. To begin, place the radiator face down and remove the blanking caps from each valve. Insert the supplied metal blanking cap and bleed valve. Make sure this is at the top of the radiator before you move on. The bleed valve needs to be at the most convenient access point side of the radiator, just in case you need to bleed it in the future. With any new radiator, it's best practice to add new valves. Remove the spigots from the valves, wrap each one around 17 times with PTFE tape. This will give a great seal to prevent any water leakage. Once the spigots are in place, insert the valve heads and nip them up with an adjustable spanner. Place the bottom brackets on the radiator and measure the centre of one bracket to the centre of the other. Now, position the bracket on the bottom in the same position and note the distance from the bracket centre to the top of the bracket. Measure the width of the radiator to find the centre point. On the wall where you are going to place the radiator, measure the height at which you want the bottom centre of the radiator to hang. This could be defined by existing piping, skirting board or even just personal preference. Mark the wall and then mark either side where the top of the bottom brackets will be. Place the top of the bottom bracket on the measured line and mark the screw hole. Do this for both sides. On the radiator, measure the height from the centre of the top valve to the centre of the bottom valve and then mark this on the wall from where the bottom centre of the radiator will sit. Measure and mark where the bottom screw hole of the top bracket will be situated, ensuring this is parallel to the bottom brackets. Mark the bracket centres on the wall either side of the centre line and then fix them into position using an impact driver. Insert the supplied rubber washers into each bracket to prevent vibration and damage and then carefully lift the radiator into position. Radiators are heavy, so be extra careful when lifting. Once the radiator is securely hung, make sure everything is level. You are now ready to connect your radiator to the system. Thank you for watching. For more informative how-to videos, please visit besteating.com. Stay safe and happy heating.